you today. I hope you're all well. Uh, it's another lovely day here in London and um, today I am going to share with you some lovely designs that I saw on a trip to Selfridges recently with a specific focus on Dior um, and there is a little unboxing in this video too so please do stay tuned. So if you are new here please make sure you subscribe below it will really really help me grow my channel and our design obsessed community so please do subscribe if you are returning thank you so much for coming back to watch my videos and i hope you all enjoy yes guys i am still obsessed with this lovely cat bag from llama the black on black is my favorite i'm really seriously thinking about that one um, but we also have these new little bags as well as an orange one which you saw there too they are gorgeous great capacity love them salvatore ferragamo anyone uh, yes i really love this electric blue surprise surprise i'm always drawn to the blue bags uh, really great capacity in this one beautiful in terms of the design love the uh, leather on this and the weaving really really gorgeous bag love 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 Rihanna and Nina I have never seen these bags before but look at the embroidery on these bags absolutely stunning patterns this one was print, not um, embroidery, but really, really pretty. Some beautiful patterns and colours. Uh, very Chanel-esque, I would say, in the style and also the closing. But really, I really love these bags. They're very, very nice. I really wanted to see this particular bag from Prada. Brand new, love the capacity and the zipper. The crossbody strap is also really great, really good size. Yeah, been in love with this one, guys. Might be going on my wish list, which is just getting so Louis Vuitton. Yeah, I wasn't bowled over. There's nothing really there at the minute that I'm dying to get. This was a new bag, I haven't seen before. Uh, yeah, so nothing really on my wish list. Christian Dior guys, absolutely love the book tote. Been wondering which one might make its way on my wish list. A lot of new designs just dropped. Um, so yes, and I really like the screen one at the top in blue. Uh, and there was some new kind of painted bags. And uh, yeah, a couple of stuff at Dior. Nice. Oh, I can here. New collection. And I might have bought a little something to unbox for you guys. But now, it's a coffee. This is so stunning guys, look at the pearls on this. And I also love this blue ombre, Lady Dior. And this one as well, which is the Dior light, I believe, in blue. from Dior to unbox with you today. Um, the first item is this one. 
uh, which is in this cute little box. It is a perfume and it is a refillable travel perfume in this beautiful Dior print. You can see the lion on it. It is the Dior Gris, which I think Gris means grey. Correct me down below if I'm wrong. So yes, yeah, so these are refillable and it fits perfectly in a handbag and it's wonderful to, for travel and a bit like the Hermes lipsticks it's got this magnetic close there's just something really satisfactory in that click um, it the scent is light with a bit of sort of citrony yeah I think it's citrony type scent to it um, it's not overpowering I really would recommend this really really nice um, so this is the first item a little refillable travel perfume from Christian Dior so next up um, I don't know if you guys are part of the Dior cosmetics club um, if you sign up for Dior online and uh, you buy the beauty products you you kind of build up your reward status and when you get to a certain level you get a gift so I got to the platinum stage recently and I kept on going into boutique to ask for my gift nobody had it nobody had it I was really sad and then I didn't want to buy any more cosmetics because I think once you start going over that bit you, you you can't say that you didn't have it so anyway I tried again and I finally managed to get it guys uh, and I thought I'd just show it to you so obviously this was a freebie um, because of my reward status with their online beauty um, account uh, and this is what the platinum gift looks like so I thought I'd share that with you it's a little booklet uh, it comes in a cute little box that says Christian Dior Paris and if we open it up ooh, two little miniature candles I don't know about you guys but I love everything to do with candles I mean and these ones aren't they just the cutest so this one it says oops let's see if it's going to show it to you oh it's not showing very well 30 Montaigne it says on this one and the candle is vanilla I think it smells a bit like vanilla it's grey so these are obviously like little testers oh it smells lovely um, and then the other one I'm not sure I'm going to be able to pronounce this it says, I think it's T. Osmantus. That might be wrong, but there we go. T. Osmantus. And this one is yellow. And this scent is sort of honeysuckle? Honey, maybe? Yeah it smells lovely so anyway so these are the two small candles that essentially were freebies um, from Dior right so now on to a real unboxing guys which I'm really excited to show you um, the first item is in this little box what do we think right so in the um, Another unboxing video I told you that I love everything to do with custom jewellery and uh, this tiny little box might tell you that this could be custom jewellery. Um, Dior packaging, yeah, it's next to none, isn't it? I mean, look how beautiful that is with the lovely silk ribbon. So shall we pull this ribbon and see what's inside? Okay. So here we go. 
Let's open this up. Ooh. I haven't actually opened this, so I'm really excited to see this with you guys. So it's a true unboxing, this one. Oh, look at that. And that little, little dust bag in there. Isn't that the cutest? Right, let's just see what this is. Okay, there's a little booklet. I'm not sure what the booklet says, but... Uh, is there anything in English in here? It's a care booklet. So, yes, here we go. And what's in the little bag? It's like a little pouch. It opens up like this. And then you can see it's see-through. And there you go. It's all revealed. It's a pair of earrings. And I am addicted to hoops. Absolutely love hoop earrings. Um, and I didn't put any on today because <laughs> I knew I was going to put these on for the first time. So there we go, guys. What do we think? So let's see, it is, the hoop is like so, it has the CD inside of the hoop and otherwise it's completely, it's like um, aged gold I would say rather than a really sparkly gold, so aged gold and most of the other hoops I have they are very very sparkly so I thought this was a nice first with a bit of aged gold. So here you go. There you go. There they are. My new Christian Dior hoop earrings with the CD. What do we think, guys? Love them. Absolutely love them. They're really nice size, aren't they? For every day. Yeah, really like them. Thank you. That is amazing. Right, so next item. Uh, yes, I went a little bit mad. <laughs> I wasn't supposed to, but this is something that has been on my wish list for a long while. So not only do I love handbags and jewelry, but I love accessories in general. So this next piece is also an accessory uh, and with the size of this box I'm pretty sure you can guess what kind of accessory. Again, look at the packaging, it is stunning. Let's pull this ribbon, beautiful silk ribbon. I haven't opened this yet, so I'm quite excited to see what it looks like. Beautifully wrapped with tissue paper and a Dior sticker. So let's open this carefully. I think I'm just going to slide it out because I don't want to ruin the sticker, guys. So here you go. This is a Dior oblique shawl. So it's not just a scarf, it's a shawl. It's quite big. Um, I prefer scarves to be quite big. I've got a lot of scarves, uh, but this is in fact my first Dior scarf. And I wanted this for such a long time, guys. Um, I think it is stunning, it's so versatile. See, it's got a darker blue on one side and on the reverse, so the print is in white and then it's in blue on the other side and it's kind of a denim color I think this um, which to me is like perfect I love anything that's blue <laughs> I think I've told you that before I'm a big blue fan uh, I wear a lot of blue and this scarf will be perfect now that we're coming into autumn um, and just kind of to dress things up or throw on and typically I will wear it around my neck you can see here the colouring 
I think it's a good colour for me. Um, and we've got the Kristen Jewel print here. So there you go. What do you think guys? Uh, do you love scarves? Do you have any scarves that um, you want to recommend? Um, this one is definitely going to go on top of my I have to wear it a lot pile. I just want to see what the material is. Um, so you can kind of get a gist of that too. That's the label there. And it says it is 60% wool. 25% silk and 15% cashmere so it is really nice and soft guys really nice and soft lovely on the skin oh love it love it love it this is going to be so nice to wear with my winter jackets um, or smaller jackets just to kind of give a little bit of comfort around the uh, the neck a bit of colour. So let me know guys what you think. Uh, did you enjoy this unboxing? Um, yeah, comment below and importantly please give it a little thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Uh, if you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe it will help us grow our little design luxury obsessed community here on my channel which as you can see is quite new but I am trying to grow our channel so anybody who wants to subscribe will be really really helpful so yeah hope you enjoyed this video everybody uh, let's put the scarf on in a bit thank you so much guys thanks for joining